Hello everyone. So in this video, we are going to discuss about Shodan's most powerful feature, which is the download feature. So what you can do with this? You can search Shodan and download the results into a file where each line is a JSON banner. So for a specific search query, you can download all the connected servers which are there onto the internet and are being crawled by Shodan easily into a file. So you will just get all the particular server's IP address, their banner, their ASN and many more details that will be helpful for you in your penetration testing or your bug bounty hunting methodology. So let us see how you can download search results for a specific search query. For that, you have to go onto your terminal and you have to search for Shodan space download. Once you give this particular command, Shodan is going to say you that you are missing some arguments. This is not the correct syntax to use this. So as you can see over here, we have to specify a file name and a search query that you want to search for. So this time we are going to give the file name as big IP because we want big IP servers list. And let us say we give the name as big IP file and the search query, as we can see over here should be big IP because we want to get the results of big IP. You can get the results for anything you want. CCTV cameras, FTP servers, Apache servers, Nginx servers, or anything that you like. I'm going to get the search results for the big IP server and I'm going to store them into a file called as big IP. I will just hit enter. After you hit enter, you can see the total number of results are 585704 and the query credits are left are this many because the query credits are being utilized when I am running this particular search result. As you can see, the output file is saved and it is saved in a zipped format, which is GZ. So we are going to use gunzip to unarchive this particular zip file. So gunzip and the file name, which is big IP file dot JSON dot GZ. So and then we are going to hit enter. Once you hit enter, you will be able to see the output of this particular file. So let me just show you how does the output looks like. I will just hit enter and you can see this particular output onto your screen, which is a very, very difficult to understand currently onto the terminal. At least if you open up this output into an editor, so I have opened up this output into a sublime editor and here it looks little bit better from the terminal version. Here you can see Shodan, the ID of that particular search, options, PTR module, HTTP crawler, and then again hash, and then OS, which stands for operating system, IPs, ISP, what is the ISP, and then HTTP, redirect is there or not, title sitemap hash so basically a lot of things about that particular server and in the last you can see the host ip address so this way you get all the details into the json file format that has been downloaded but here into this particular editor it still looks little bit difficult to visualize and understand so what you can do is you can just control A and control C, which will copy all of the results. Just go onto your browser and go onto this particular website, which is jasonbeautifier.org. Here you can paste the whole output and now hopefully it looks a little bit more readable and which we can understand. As you can see here, there are total 1000 results that we have pasted. So let us just scroll all the way down and let's see if we have 1000 results. 
all right so we have the 1000 results over here perfect now let us go back up and let's understand one of the output that we have got so let me just read the first output for you and how does it look like so now from here to here is the first output of the first specific ip and you can see the ip address of the host is 104.101.104.172 the host name is also given here as you can see it is deployed on akamai technologies the location is also there but shudan has not able to identify that but it has identified the longitudes for you the country where the server is located is united states these are the latitudes you can see the timestamp when it was crawled the domain as we already saw it was akamai technologies the organization is again akamai and when you go on to this particular ip as you can see you will get a redirect and the location will be https so you'll be redirected to a https version of it the server which is very important for us is big ip because we have crawled or we have downloaded the search results specifically for big ip and we have got a lot of results you can also increase the result count of your search query and we will see that how to do how to do that in the upcoming video so i hope you guys understood how you can download the results of a specific search query and from that you can just observe whatever the software version is running and if you have a exploit you can start mass exploitation of all those servers i hope you guys understood thank you